What is up all you beautiful people and welcome to another episode of the Only Chests Iron Man account. And before we get started today's episode, I have a pretty major announcement. I am going to start streaming sometime in February. I'm going to be returning to Gauntlet. We're almost done with all of our prep work for raids, so I'm super excited for that. So make sure you don't miss those streams and by doing that, you hit that subscribe button and you turn that bell notification icon on so you get notified every time I upload a new video and go live. For today's episode, it really brings me pain and suffering. Of course, you guys are going to get to see. So if you enjoy watching YouTubers go through hell, then uh, this is the episode for you. Without further ado, let's get into that beautiful chest content. I bet you all are wondering what we're doing here. Well, it's quite a simple story, really. So, you know, just in the middle of doing my shades and uh, get my elite clue. I'm like four or five steps in. Next thing you know, the next step is one of the four I can't do. However, I can actually get this item from easy clues. It's that damn Bob shirt. So here we are. I'm going to be grinding these out until we get one. Um, we're, look, we're only chests for a reason. I'm not dropping that clue, so... Let's go ahead and start opening these bad boys. I cannot open a casket in this area. All right, well then I will just go right outside my house and start slamming these bad boys open. All right, nothing there. And I'm probably just gonna drop a lot of this stuff here. Nothing, nothing. Just go ahead and start dropping some of this stuff. I uh, already have the armor book completed, but um, don't really need it. Nope. 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 Okay. You know, the fact that we've gotten zero uniques. Okay. Well, we got one. Not exactly what I uh, wanted, but you know what? At least it's a unique. Hey, we are back. Another 20 easy caskets. I did these bad boys while I was laying in bed watching some TV and listening to some podcasts. So let's go ahead and slap these open. See if we can get uh, more uniques than what we did last time. So far, it's not really looking good. Well, there's a goblin mask. Don't uh, don't really like that. Really need a bob shirt. There's a double unique plate body H3 and studded chaps G. Not too shabby. There's a bronze kite shield G. That is a unique as well. Let's go ahead and bank some of this stuff here. Anything that uh, is a unique, I am keeping in the inventory and it's getting slapped <laughs> right in unless I just don't have room. So looks like I don't have room for that. All right, 10 more to go. All right, there's the Armadil robe legs. Didn't really need those. Man, really, really just looking for that Bob shirt. Oh, come on. Nope. 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 Oh, no. Oh, well, you know, it's all good. We didn't get it. Not yet, anyway. I'm going to keep trying because I'm not dropping this clue step. All right, we got 16 easy clues. I went ahead and did as much as I could before needing to go somewhere. And this will bring us to an even total 90. So let's just start slapping them open see if we can get a Bob shirt. Did we really just get a gilded apron? That is three new items in one scroll. That is actually insane when you look at that clue. All right, well, not exactly what I needed. Uh, nothing there. Guthix page. That's a new one. Actually, that's going to complete the book, so that's pretty nice. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing. Nope. Um, Guthix robe top is new. All right. Not too bad. Let's go ahead and deposit some of this stuff here that is not unique. Because I have very little room in my actual bank, so... All this stuff will be going in the house as soon as we uh, get on over there. All right, last seven um, studded chaps tea. So we have the full set now. Very uh, cool, I guess. Looking for that Bob shirt, though. Come on. This is honestly 
not very enjoyable. All right, well, we did not get uh, Bob's shirt, but we did add a bunch of new items to the uh, log there, so I guess I'll take it. I wasn't uh, really expecting to, you know, get absolutely spooned here, but I mean, God forbid, I'm 12 clues behind a 2000 KC. I just, oh my gosh, I don't even know. This is rough. I've got 10 more easy clues here and I'm just doing 10 this time around since this will put us at an even 100 and I'm hoping that that luck will give us a Bob shirt. So far, absolutely no uniques. That's a duplicate. Five more clues, trash, 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 and trash. We didn't even have to empty out the inventory. So that is 100 easies done. Oh my gosh, let's take a look here. Uh, 2,539 ham pickpockets on my desktop. Only 35 easy clues. So realistically, for those of you who don't know, it's a one out of 50 chance to get these bad boys. By 2000 KC, we should have averaged right around 40. So the fact that we're only at 35 and it's 2,539 KC uh, hurts a little on the inside. I've done about seven or 800 pickpockets on my laptop. My odds are not much better there either. So, I mean, we are just significantly behind the rate here, unfortunately. We've got 20 more easy clues. This will get us to 120. God, I really hope we can get it. Okay, well, at least we're starting off with a unique, which is nice. Uh, nothing there, nothing there, nothing there, nothing. I have that Bandos page already. I'm going to be honest with you. Our unique to easy ratio is god awful. It is bad. I mean, it is just not good at all in the slightest. I, I was like looking over the clips and I'm just like, oh my God, this is absolutely atrocious. This is not good at all. Now let's just keep opening them up. All right, uh, looks like that's two new items. Unfortunately, neither are a Bob shirt. Why do I feel like this grind is literally gonna take me ages? And I'm really hoping that I am incorrect here. Oh boy. Yep. Yeah, I mean, it's just, it's rough. And uh, I'm still going dry on the clues. So uh, yeah, there's another 20 down. Unfortunately, uh, nothing too exciting. Let's go ahead and look at the collection log here. I only have 25 uniques out of 120 clues. That's actually kind of insane uh, that it's that low. I feel like I do a lot better on other accounts, to be completely honest, with uh, easy clues. All right, I've got another 10 easy clues. I just wanted to let you guys see what we've got so far. 25 uniques out of 120 clues. Honestly, not the best rate. If we go over to the shared rewards, we are actually only missing one Bandos page. We have hit the table a whopping 13 times, most out of any other pages that I've able to uh, been able to obtain here. And um, for whatever reason, can't get that illustrious page to let's go ahead and slap these 10 open, though. And I just hope I can get a Bob shirt. <clears throat> All right. So that's an iron plate body trim. Already have that. Ancient page three. Already have that. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nope. Staff of the Bob cat. Wrong Bob item. Iron plate body G also looks like a new reward for it. Oh my God, yes. Oh my God, thank you so much. Oh my God. Oh, and the last possible clue. Oh, the grind for that is finally done. That is 130 easy clues completed. Oh, thank goodness. I'm gonna go try and complete this elite now. All right, Jagex, let me get this straight. I spend four days straight grinding out easy clues just to get this Ooh. fucking elite step. The one that I never wanted to do for the Pyromancer robe. 
and it might not seem like it's that bad but for the account i would literally spend probably over a week trying to get this damn item and utilize none of the stuff from winter tot it's like the one step i don't want to get anything for i don't care about getting the straw hat i don't care about getting the shazian body five the pyromancer robe the fact that you just don't get to pick which item you get whenever you roll like you do with the rogue's outfit oh man is this irritating i feel like i've wasted the past four days getting this pop shirt on on step five as well you know i mean legitimately the next step right after this so honestly that sucks i'm dropping it because i'm not doing this i'm not wasting a, a week or more of my time trying to get the bottom so when i can utilize absolutely nothing uh from winter tot so back to shades i go hopefully uh we'll have better luck with the elite steps next time we're going to be taking a little break from shades i still need to gather in grand total right under 8,000 teak logs for 77 construction so i'm just going to be chopping some at the moment i need some hyper afk stuff so that's what i'm going to be doing uh, at the moment we have around 3,300 so still have a good amount to go ah there we are 80 wood cutting it was only a matter of time until we got that skill up to 80 from all the magics and teaks I have to cut. But uh, there it is. I still have a few thousand teaks left to cut. We were pretty close to 80 when we started. We just got the Zealots row bottom and I just realized I did not switch my last screen from my last clip. So we're not gonna use that, but I am gonna explain what happened. So uh, we went ahead and did a hard clue scroll and I ended up getting a Zamorak full helm. Super nice. It is a clue step requirement for a master clue step. So. That is nice to snag. We are only missing one more zealot piece. Absolutely amazing. I always forget that this gives fire making experience until I'm recording another clip for uh, <laughs> for level up. That's 86 fire making. Um, uh, like really, I'm actually only two items away from completing shades. And to be honest, I can't really tell if I'm happy or disgusted. <laughs> I, I genuinely just had no idea how much Shades content we were going to do when we started this account, and it's been absolutely hilarious along the way. All right, with this deposit of logs, we are finally done collecting all of our takes, which means we will be going back to Shades. Still have a good amount of remains together, about a thousand left to go. We've already burned through over 800 logs as well. We've got uh, some keys saved up from when we've gotten our clues and went to go do them, but uh, nothing too crazy. Got a beautiful hard clue casket here. Oh my gosh, that's, wow, that's real bad. Wow, hey. Another hard clue casket for you, ladies and gentlemen. And other than the Dragon Boots ornament kits and, you know, the Fable Third Age, not really much we're looking for out of here. And uh, not really much that we got. Double fire lighters, that feels pretty bad. But that is 130 hard clues completed. <laughs> well, it didn't take us long to get another hard clue. Next inventory, we ended up snagging one. Let's go ahead and slap this open. All right, just some um, Alex Force, nothing too exciting. Getting a, another prayer level here. That is level 76. We are one away, and I can tell you right now with 100% confidence, we do have enough fear remains here to get us from 76 to 77. So. That is going to be another goal marked off before we start raids. Well, all you beautiful ladies and gentlemen, that is going to wrap it up for today's episode. And I'm going to be honest, I had completely forgotten how irritated I got at that elite clue. I mean, you can just hear the disdain and just how disgruntled I was when I got those two steps back to back after grinding those easy clues for like four to five days. And it wouldn't be bad if ham members at some point had a success rate of 100%. Even though the females are 15 thieving, for whatever reason, you always have a fail rate. And it's that was just what was irritating to me. Oh my gosh. Honestly, though, I'm so done. We have that Bob shirt. Thank goodness. I'll now be able to do that step later on. And I'm sure I will get it again. I just never want to see those two steps back to back.
If you guys ended up enjoying today's episode and you are new to the channel, just make sure you hit that thumbs up button, subscribe, and turn that bell notification icon on. Check out the description as well for the playlist that's down there, as well as the Discord link if you want to come in, join, hang out, talk. I'm always in there, pretty active. So come on in. And I just want to give a special shout out to Father Duo and Rob K. Rob K is a Crystal Tier member. Thank you so much. And Father Duo is a Master Tier. Thank you all so much. And I will see all you beautiful people next Monday.